I am so glowy. I love it. Hello my YouTube beauties and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to talk about the Jaclyn Hill, I'm probably blinding you, Champagne Collection Eye Palette. This is what the packaging looks like. I am going to do a first impressions. I'll put inserts of me putting the actual eye look on. It is what I have on my eyes today. Of course it is again the mirrored packaging with the little spots around it and you open it up ah! you open it up and it has the little insert on top saying what the names are and this is what you get out of the package there are five eyeshadows there are two shimmers and three mattes the first one is called chardonnay that's the white one it has white with gold reflex in it. The second one is Champagne Toast. That one it was specifically created by Jaclyn Hill. And then there's Cordial, which is a matte, medium toned pink. There is Cognac, which is a neutral matte brown. And then there's Bordeaux, which is a dark matte plum shade. I am just as excited for this palette as I was for the face palettes. She did come out with a face palette that has two highlights and three blushes. Went up on my channel last week, I believe. I just got this in the mail today. First off, I've never used Becca eyeshadows before. I love the two shimmers. I have Chardonnay on the inner corners of my eye, uh, Champagne Toast on my lid, and then I have the these three kind of smudged underneath my lower lash line. First off, I'm gonna say my first impression is really good for this palette. I think that Becca's eyeshadows are really buttery. They glide on. They are really pigmented. I think Champagne Toast is really the best one out of all of them. It's this one right here. and and Chardonnay. I'm gonna say those two are for a tie. The shimmer shades are really buttery. So are the matte shades. They blend really easily. I did this eye look in about five minutes. I love the packaging. Of course, the label. I, I'm all about packaging. And it has the shades on the back of the package. I just love how thin and sleek this is. I think it looks really high-end. What is that from? That's just... So you can see throughout this video me applying the eyeshadow. I like Champagne Toast on my lids, but I think on my eyelid it looks more like an overlay, kind of. I think it can suit a lot of skin tones. I think this palette can suit a lot of skin tones. I think they did a really good job with the color range. I just wanted to jump on here real quick and give you my thoughts. I think this palette is really great. I paid... I should know this. Uh, this palette was $40. I think it's a little steep considering the naked palettes are 50 and you get three times as many eyeshadows. I think you are paying for the brand and for Jaclyn Hill's name on it. On the package, it doesn't look like you get a ton of product in this, though I think that this is really gonna be a go-to palette for me. I think the colors are beautiful. I do think they could have added a little bit more for your money. But overall, I'm really happy that I bought it. If you have your the chance to get your hands on something like this, then I definitely would because it is limited edition. She made that very clear that although Champagne Pop became permanent, this collection will not. I think it's good that she kind of was clear about that. Hopefully this little first impressions mini review demo really helped you get your mind around what this palette is, what it looks like. I think it's worth the money if you don't want to miss out on this limited edition item. I think that the face palette maybe is a little bit better value just because it has three blushes and two um, highlights. So I would probably pick that over this. I'm still really happy with the quality and the formulation and the colors that they picked. They're beautiful colors. I'm going to use this up and I'm really excited to use this. So if you already have it, Yes. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Please give it a thumbs up if you liked this video. Subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.